guys, so it's weighing day. Don't worry, we're not gonna cook anything this video. You guys keep watching. Second week of us showing you guys his pull up. I'm gonna try both of them. We'll try to do underhand and I'm gonna try to do column. Okay. Know, either way I can do it. That's fair. Right. So here we go. Let's see where he's at. Try to get him all the way in here. Oh, he held himself up for an extra second that time. You held yourself up a little longer that time. Yeah, about the same. About the same. Pretty good. Hey guys, it's Josh. And Zach. And if you're new to the channel, we want to thank you for watching. What this channel is about is Zach and I are both on a journey for fitness and for weight loss. We're new to it. We're trying to learn different things. We experiment with different diets. We try different workout regimes and we want you guys to come along with us. So it's Monday. Yep, weigh-in day. Weigh-in day, so we're gonna do the weights. Yep, what you got? I think, I think I've probably gained weight. That's how I feel. Yeah, I, I mean. I feel like I've either, nothing's happened or, which I don't, don't know why. I mean, I have to be honest, like I've not been really strict on the diet. I have kind of fallen off a couple times, which is common for me. Um, but yeah, I'd say I'm about the same, if anything. So let's go ahead and get right to the weights. All right, Zachy boy. Here we go. Oh boy, a little nervous, a little nervous. I don't want to know, I do want to know. Okay, 178.6. 178.6, right. not too bad. Joshua. All right, Zach's been complaining about my old man socks. Yes, I have. So Not really. I'm wearing some non. Yeah, you have. You did. Not like said it. anything about that. You did. What are we looking? Three twenty-five point four. All it's right. A little bit of a loss. A little bit of improvement. Okay. All right, guys. So there's the weights. Surprised. Pretty good. Yeah. So we're both a down. We're both a down. Both down, down. down. We're a down. You know. We're both down yeah. a pound. So that's pound pretty good. Pound and a half. Pound and a half. Pound and a half. Right. Each. So it does matter. <laughs> yeah. So we're both down a pound and a half. So that's pretty good. So we're weird though. I felt like I gained. Well, do you know how your body feels? And I was like, for sure, I gained a pound at minimum. But even if we were doing poorly with the food, we've been really kicking it up on our workouts. I mean, speaking of workouts, you guys saw at the beginning of the video, there was another attempt of me trying to do a pull-up. And this time I realized that there's different ways to do a pull-up, so I did underhanded and also did overhanded. I don't feel like I'm making any kind of, I mean, of course I probably am making some kind of progress, progress a little bit. I just can't feel like I'm still struggling with it. But we're gonna get there. I, I seem to think he held himself up. Like I said in the video. Yeah, holding up a little more. Yeah, I think you just kinda were you just kinda got stuck. I didn't want to yeah, like, like go like oh, a right. I got this and you know, but that's good. But like we talked about, we've done some circuit training and things. We've been working on our shoulders, working on our backs. Today we did a pretty good uh leg, leg. yeah, today was leg day. So we're just gonna keep going with the workouts. Yeah. So as far as uh, workouts go, we talked about that challenge where we were challenging ourselves to not just go to the gym, but spend an entire hour at the gym. That's right. And I'm happy to report that we were successful. Yeah. So the entire time that we did, we completed it, right? We we're did. done now. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Two weeks. Two weeks. Although, yeah, two full weeks. I don't think we're going to stop. Yeah, to be completely honest, you're in there for the hour. It's it's easy if you're doing your workouts because mm -hmm. you just keep your mind on it. Yeah. And you feel, you feel like you have to accomplish that goal, so you're getting a better workout by being in there an hour. I know they recommend at least 30 minutes a day, but if you got an hour to do it, do it. And be quite honest, I got so used to it, I forgot it was a challenge. I yeah. forgot it was our challenge. I just said, all right, well, we have an hour today and didn't even think, oh, that's our challenge. Which it is, just became part of our workout. Exactly, which is how you wanted to do. You wanted yeah. to become kind of a lifestyle change. You wanted to become a habit, yeah. which is what it was doing. So that's, that's, yeah. that's good. You said so, you had some questions for Yeah, me. I do have some questions for you. So you've go. been taking your medicine, correct? Yes, every, I've been, day. every right. day I've been taking my medication. Have there been any changes? Yes, so here's okay. what the changes is. So just to update anybody who's new to watching our videos, I have something that's called Hashimoto's disease, which is just a thyroid disorder, okay? So if you look into it, like people that have hypothyroidism, hyperthyroidism, or Hashimoto's disease, any of those types of things, it can affect weight gain, it can affect weight loss, it can affect all these different types of things. So when my weight started going up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, or yo-yoing, um, decided that it was time for me to go to the doctor because I was on medicine for a long time for Hashimoto's disease and I stopped taking it. Um, I'm very stubborn when it comes to medication and going to the doctor, like men typically are. Um, so, I've been taking it again. Um, the biggest change is, 
Not so much with the weight loss or weight gain or the energy or anything, which is what I'm trying to improve. But Sweet. I will have, yeah, I will have to say. <laughs> I knew it. Well, but see, I will have to say, like, because of late, you know, I'll sleep, but it's light sleep. Like, I'll wake up every few hours, wake up a few hours, wake up every few hours, and then just kind of be dragging towards the morning. But at least this past week, I have been sleeping like a baby. Like, deep sleep. <laughs> to the point to where my alarms are having to go off a couple times for me to actually get up. And which I'm cool with, which I'm cool with, but I'm sleeping so deep that when I'm waking up, it's like, wait, well, huh, where am I? What's yeah. going on? And <laughs> I'm having- Because not used to it. No, right, and I'm having these incredibly, incredibly vivid dreams, hmm. which I'm cool with, as long as they're interesting, but in this case, they're kind of weird, <laughs> and they're kind of sticking with me throughout the day. Um, yeah. That's fine, but you know, having better sleep, and sleeping better, getting better, more a deep sleep like yeah. that, is gonna help your body out for sure. always throughout the day yeah. with your energy eventually. I think your body maybe is in the stage where it's catching up on sleep. Maybe, and, and so. you know, the, and the medicine that I'm taking uh, for Hashimoto's is it takes it weeks, if not a couple months, to actually really kind of start to take effect. I have to go back to the doctor after I've been on the medicine for a little while to get my uh, my levels tested uh, to make sure that it's actually helping me. Mm. So we won't know until I go back to the doctor, which is in a few more weeks. Yeah. So that's the update on that. That's good. Yeah. Good improvements. Hopefully, uh, we'll continue to see those improvements as we keep going. Yeah. I mean, you lost a pound and a half this time instead of going bouncy house. So <laughs> we'll true. see next week. Unless you know, I gain six time. pounds next week. No, well, we're going to keep going with it. We're going to keep going with the workouts and stuff. Speaking of workouts. Yeah. So we have a workout here. We're going to show you guys that we did the other day. Um, we're going to go ahead and put it in. Yeah, yeah sure. All right. Hey guys, it's Josh and Zach the boy in the gym. Uh, we're doing the hour gym like we normally do, but today we're working on back. So we're gonna do a circuit. So we're gonna do four exercises. We're gonna keep doing those exercises back to back to back to back for 20 minutes. But Zach's gonna demonstrate on how to do it. So when well, you're ready, sir. First one. Yep. Keep it back straight. Pull your chest. All right. Next, pretty simple. Give me a deadlift with the dumbbell. Okay. Alright, so your typical deadlift. Okay. Alright, we're going that one down. There it is, that's what we're doing for 20 minutes. Um, back to back to back to back to back. This is what my face looks like before the 20 minutes. And guys, this is my face after the 20 minutes. It was a good one. All right guys, that's kind of a taste of what we do at the gym every day. So what that was, is I kind of explained in the video, is a circuit. So we, have, we give ourselves three or four different exercises. Um, say on this exercise, we're gonna do eight reps. This one, we're gonna do 10. And we'll time ourselves for like 20, 25 minutes. And the point is you just continue to do those exercise, exercises as many as you can in that span of 20 or 25 minutes. Push. Yeah, for sure. And it's, and it's weightlifting for sure, but I'm oh, telling yeah. you, your heart rate goes up. It's also <laughs> cardio. It's it's a work. I don't like it. It's probably the closest thing to CrossFit. Yeah, pretty close. Which really, I'm, I which mean, to be honest, I'm really not familiar with. But from yeah. my understanding, it's a mixture of the two, cardio yeah. and weightlifting. Um, and I like to put myself behind him in that line so that I can be like, hurry up, get moving, right, go, sure. get out of the way. Because he is in better shape than I am. I'm, most likely, I'm like, <laughs> and he's like, I'm ready to go to the next. Still one. out of breath too, but you know, no, I'm still going. No, not really, not really. Either <laughs> way, yep. So um, there was something I was reading the other day about eating prior to sleep. Thought that was very interesting. I, I've always heard a lot of things. We've all heard things of we should, you shouldn't eat. A lot of bodybuilders are saying you should eat a protein shake before you go to sleep. Well, let me just explain this. If you eat in within the two hour, two to three hour window before you go to bed, you are affecting, you could be affecting multiple things. Indigestion. You could be causing your, cell, your body to have irregulated blood sugar levels. Mm -hmm. You could be waking up not feeling rested at all. You could actually have an increased um, chance of stroke. So, so for that reason, 
you know, he kind of brought this up to me. I did think that was interesting. And it certainly is, I don't know if he is necessarily, but I'm a snacker. All the way up until it's time for bedtime, which is partly, you know, while I'm overweight. I'm definitely a snacky boy. So, <laughs> snacky boy. Snacky boy. So, um, <laughs> what we're going to try, we were trying to think, you know, kind of we need to give ourselves a new challenge. Um, so, what this is going to be, it's definitely not one of the more difficult, well, it could be. It I have no be. idea. It could yeah. be a hard one. Mental. Mentally, for sure. Yeah. So, uh, for the next two weeks, that's going to be our goal is to not eat after 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock? Done. Done. Nothing. Water. Yeah, water. That's it. That's it. Yeah. That's it. And then apparently, you know, along with some of the things that you it can kind of help avoid, um, apparently will also help with increased uh, energy throughout the day um, because you're not, your body's not, you're not sluggish at night and all this. I mean, it's just, you know, that's just some of the things that it can kind of result in. Yeah. So for two weeks, we're going to try not to eat after eight o'clock in the evening. Yeah. Which, yeah. I mean, even me, I will consciously make the effort to not eat but if i get a little frustrated or if i'm just anxious for some reason i'm like oh chips right or i just want to go have like some berries or something i mean just anything that i can find that's available yep. that's small i'm like it's not that bad that's going to be my struggle is the little bits and pieces where it's not enough to even just satisfy hunger it's just because i want it right i think that's where i'm going to struggle a little bit so yep. but it will be better i do suffer from indigestion Every day. So. I serve from heartburn. I take medicine yeah. for it. So maybe this will help. I'm hoping it'll help a little bit. Yeah. But guys, I think that's it for this week. So we want you guys to look forward on our video coming out on Thursday. Uh, we don't know if you loved it, you hated it, you thought it was funny, you thought it was stupid. Or gross. Or gross. It was, it was pretty it was gross. gross. Yeah, it was gross yeah. for sure. Uh, we did attempt to cook a healthy, healthier meal um, on our last video. And it was fun. It was definitely fun yeah. to film. But what we cooked... We must have did it wrong, or it was just a bad recipe. I think we did it wrong, or we did too much. Don't know. I, mean, I don't know, yeah. I'm going to put a link up here so you guys can go check it out. So yeah. for sure, go ahead and go check out our cooking video. We cooked blueberry, no. Blackberry. Blackberry chicken. You said, last you said it in the video. Too. Did I, did I say blueberry? He said, we're going to have some blueberries. And I'm going, this is black. Black, blackberry okay. video. Yeah. It sounded, I mean, to me, it sounded pretty good, but... Spoiler it alert, good. it did not it work out. But, but <laughs> yeah, on the next video uh, coming up on Thursday, we are going to announce what our next uh, healthier meal is that we're going to attempt to cook. And we're not going to tell you what it is, but let's say it's going to be in honor of St. Patrick's Day. So you guys keep an eye out for that. I also do want to remind everyone that, if, especially if this is your first time watching our videos, we would appreciate it if you would like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know what you would like to see in our videos. Let us know how we're doing. We always want encouragement on our journey of weight loss and trying to be fitter. And if you guys are doing a weight loss journey or trying to be fitter and you have any questions or you just want to let us know how you're doing, please do that. We genuinely, genuinely want to know. Yeah. You got anything else? I think that's it. All right, guys. That's it for this week. I'm Josh. I'm Zach. And we're going to keep going. Thanks, Thanks guys. guys.